Do you think you'll start reading your Bible every day? I won't lie to you. Not really. I'm not, I'm not going to lie, you know. Yeah, why not? Why Why, why would you say you won't? I, I'm not going to say I don't have the time because I have the time, yeah. I don't like reading. I never read a book in my life. So you don't like reading, but do you read things on the internet? I read chat. There you go. So you read chat messages from your friends. You're reading things. And so if a friend sent you a message and you just ignored it, they asked you, hey, did you read that message I sent you? And you're like, nah, I couldn't be bothered. I didn't want to read it. Couldn't care less. How would they feel? Sad. Right. And so God sent you a chat message. It's called the Bible. And if we tell God, hey, I don't really have time to read your Bible every day, but I do have time to read all my chat messages from my friends. What are we saying to God then? That we don't have the time to listen to him. Right. We're saying that our friends and other things are more important than God. See, that's a problem. Yeah. Why do you eat food every day? To stay healthy, not die. Yeah. So why would you read the Bible every day? I cannot say to stay healthy. Well, to stay healthy spiritually, isn't it? Yeah. Otherwise, you're going to just be influenced by the world. You can often drift away from Christ. Maybe this is a wake-up call to really take it seriously and saying no Bible, no breakfast, no read, no feed, or even no Bible, no looking at your phone. So you said it as a rule. If you don't read your Bible, you can't look at your phone in the day. Would that challenge you to read it? Yeah, it will. It will.